The greatest part of doing these residencies is watching young people open up. My name is Richard Duart Brown, and I've had the privilege of uh, giving a relationship to people or going to make art with people who thought they were coming to community service and they found that it was actually fun. They express how much it is and how important it is. It's almost like they pick up hope again. It's like it surprises me every time when they open up and give you a trust place. They give you that space when they go back to being a child and pure. And, and, and they want this exchange of an adult. They begin to want again. They begin to just really come alive. And when it happens, it just feels like that's the ultimate art. The um, walking into a person who closed off, who's been hurt, and making art with the person that begins to open up and be who they were born to be. My name is Dante Woods Spikes, and I've never been much of a painter, but I consider myself to be a person that can paint relationships. What I do in the workshop is I assist Richard Duart Brown, and as he's painting, I'll talk to a lot of the kids that are involved and begin to build a relationship with them to where they become comfortable and they become way more involved in the artwork that they're doing. Because a lot of times when it comes to art, one of the first things you hear kids say is, oh man, I can't paint, I can't draw, or I don't want to get messy. It's so many reasons as to why they feel they can't do art. And what I've learned, the best way to get past that barrier is to just have an open, honest conversation with them. How are you doing? How are you feeling? And also just being open and honest about who you are because art is something that's very passionate and is very personal and a lot of times we don't take that into consideration but what I've learned especially here at the spot for youth created by Logo Art is that you have to be patient because what I've learned was that some of the kids here that I didn't expect to really dive in the way they did showed me that they had one of the most amazing artists lying dormant inside of them exposing a part of them that they didn't know existed and they'll like it and it's something that they'll share with themselves and the rest of the world pretty much for the rest of their lives so it's good to always pay close attention to what you say and what you do because you could end up breaking a child's spirit and also you could end up exposing a part of them that they didn't know existed and they'll like it and it's something that they'll share with themselves and the rest of the world pretty much for the rest of their lives it doesn't matter what color it doesn't matter which race it doesn't matter the religion or the ethnicity it's all about coming together as one and doing what we do best and if you ask me i would have to say that life is art so when we're creating art we're just living our lives